found the first one that I found. The other one's probably in like the northeast, not north, southeastern keep. Here's the first one, guys! Get the heart container. Obviously the harder to get since it's in the northwestern keep. Ooh. You know, far past where you need to go. Sure enough, southeastern Ooh. keep held my prize. Also, ow! He hit me out of the animation. Alrighty then. Because I didn't hit A again right there. What the hell? What was that? So guys, I just played this entire mission. I finished it. It was loading up the results screen when my Wii U crashed. I'll get it next episode. I'm not doing it again. Not so soon. My heart isn't ready. Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Hyrule Warriors Adventure Map. So, in the last episode, I, we, we played as freaking Ganondorf over here, and we did some other missions, and I said that I would be getting the heart pieces and stuff, but after playing through some stuff, my Wii U just crashed. It made a, we, we, a weird noise. Really freaking weird noise, and I'm just... I don't know what's wrong. But, all the same, I'm pretty sure I know what to do. I don't know what to do. I'm guessing there's a bombable wall right here? I'm not gonna take a chance. Haha, -ha, I called it! I freaking called it. No one can just, like, fight me on the fact that I freaking called it. So... What weapon is that? I don't actually recognize the weapon. Weird. I'm probably being stupid, and that's something here he has. Actually, that doesn't look like anything he has. It's recommended that I use water. I don't have water. I could use my Hylian sword that I got. A freaking magical sword right up in here. But, let's be honest, it's more fun to play with my horse. That's my horse! Alright. See ya? Wait, really? I'm fighting with Sia? Okay, if I'm... That's weird. I mean, I don't remember a time when that's been a thing. Fighting with Sia in one of these? The only real taste of that we had was during the DLC thing. I'm glad I actually waited to play this game though. Because all the DLC and updates that have happened, I would have had to come back and revisit things just to show stuff off. Kinda wish I had other games, I had been doing more games while doing this though. But, starting, like, I'm gonna wait to upload anything I already have recorded for, uh, from other projects. Because a lot of it's like, other people's commentary and stuff. I'm gonna wait to do any co-op stuff or anything that I've done thus far until the end of this series. The moment I finish this adventure mode series, I'm going to start uploading some solo stuff, one of which I'm excited for and regretting so much after a few days of thinking about it, but I will be doing it. And the other one that I'm doing, I'm just so freaking ready. My, my body is the most ready. And also, fun, fun story time, guys. I've been having weird issues with my 3DS recently. There was something stuck in the screen, and that's why I haven't been doing any uh, mystery dungeon stuff for the past like month. That and vacation, illness, everything else. But really, I haven't done anything with it in a while because I've even been able to record. I finally took it apart, got the stuff I needed to take it apart, despite the fact that the capture card, when they installed it, they made it nearly impossible to even do something with it because of how they did it. So I finally got it all apart and, you know, uh, got it fixed just to try to put it back together and to find out that my shoulder button is wired as well. 
So I had to order a new one. It'll be here in a few days, and after that, I'll be able to do more stuff with Mystery Dungeons. That'll be a probably ongoing series for a little while while we're trying to figure some stuff out with that. But I think in the next month we'll be able to announce something cool with that. I'm just not I'm not gonna say it because I'm not really sure if it's gonna happen. But I want to say something cool, so just look out for that for anyone who actually bothers. You know, like watching that stuff. I don't know how many people actually watch this and the other series. Because I know, as of this point, my most popular series on my channel is Sonic and the Dark Knight. It's just the most popular thing on the channel. The second would probably be my Paper Mario series. But Sonic and the Black Knight beats out that by far. And that's weird. Like, really weird for me because. I don't think I did a good job with it, honestly. I like the series. Looking back on it, I really enjoyed playing the game, and I have a lot of fun and fond memories of it. But I do not think it was my best work. So take that as you may. I'm just sorry for not talking. I'm trying to focus on murdering everything's faces. Gotcha. That actually did not deal much and also did not put him in the state I wanted him in. I wanted him to weak point gauge to pop up. Olga, you're in danger. Alright, Olga, you and I will have a talk in a minute. We'll see about responsibility. I forget how difficult these are supposed to be now that I think about it. Because I'm playing Link. A dark cap force will get a flea already? Alright, fine. I'll go and help out people and be a good Samaritan and stuff. Now it's just Sia and I. There's no raid captains or anything in here. North. Okay. <sighs> right. Uh, Fairy's Fountain. I'll take this keep up here. This keep shall become the mine. If you didn't think I've done this before, then you obviously don't know my legend half as well as you think you do. I'm the legendary hero. Seriously though, these Dinalfos are taking more hits than they should. This is starting to remind me more of hero mode. My special attacks aren't even taking out freaking corner of these normal guys' health. Except for that. Okay, the moment I start freaking talking is the moment I start dealing damage. Were they all just guarding before and I just caught them when they were, didn't have their guards up? See ya? Oh god, you're at half health already. Okay, time to kill everything involved here. 
can't let my commander go. I mean, to be fair, my commander has a huge crush on me, so it's kind of weird. But all the same, you can't just let her die. That's not really cool. Alright. Got you all. Now that they don't stand a chance up in this corner, I'm going to head this way, destroy the remaining forces up here, then I'll take the Fairy's Fountain. Well, I guess it's not really the Fairy's Fountain, it's the Inner Statue Sanctuary or whatever. Or is it? Yeah. Inner Statue Sanctuary, then Fairy's Fountain. That's the word. Alright. Raid captains, babies, darlings. I've already killed 1,700 people. I perform genocide whenever I start fighting. Seriously, I wonder, how many people has anyone actually killed on one battlefield? Because, like, freaking, when you think of the people who've killed the most people in war and things, there's, like, Hitler did that thing where he killed hundreds, hundreds of thousands of people. Actually, I think he was in the millions? I think he was in the middle. And that was for the genocide. But in one battlefield has one man killed. How many? I don't mean how many has he caused to die or anything. I don't mean a general leading an army. I mean one person going around fighting. Is there anyone who could even break thousands upon thousands? Oh, I thought it won for a moment. I was like, what? I didn't really mean to. Beat the enemy commander. I won't even give me seconds. Okay, outpost captain is deaded. Various fountain will become mine. Also, I like how they think they have any like choices here. Because I bet they'll still be fighting back until the end. But the thing is, I've killed 1,800 of them. I've taken every keep almost single hand. There we go. I was wondering if they were hiding things on this map. I don't think they... I think it was just this heart container. I I think it was a heart container. But, uh... Yeah, it was a container. Yeah, I think it's just this heart container and nothing else hidden. If I remember the... Search screen. But I cannot be quoted on that because I'm kind of dumb and don't remember things very well. Oh well. Now, prepare my fairy, and let's do this. It's you and me, this final battle, this always happens. Don't worry, I can't think of anything clever to say. Boy, I'll put you to bed. That's actually kind of line that I I like the little video game quips that some characters have. Like they're not something that anyone would ever say, but they just kind of sting in a way. Because after all I've grown and all I've fought through every journey, Ganondorf's always prevailed. He's always survived. He keeps surviving through every journey every time Link fights him just to face another Link and be beaten again. So, I wonder, who's really winning? Because Ganondorf always survives, he always outlives the hero. And he's been through so many heroes. There's... There's Zelda 1, there's A Link to the Past, there's Zelda 2, there's... Uh... Let's see... Ocarina of Time, Twilight Princess, uh, what other ones had Ganondorf? I'm trying to think, because I know a lot of them did. I know that was all, I know the Oracle of Ages and Seasons was trying to revive Ganondorf, but, you know, he wasn't alive during that point, so he was killed before that. So, where exactly, 
how many times has Gendorf been in the game? Because he's been in the game almost as many times as Link has. Like, not really, because Link's been every single one of them. But he's been in so many freaking one of them. So it's always him or Vati that are the main antagonists. Triple A. The Great Forest Fairy? A great fairy follows you, attacking enemies as she goes. Coordinate combo attacks with her, or use a strong enough, a strong attack to increase your attack strength at the cost of some defense. Oh, that's a weapon I've never got before, and I just got the rank two of it. I just got the twenty-five thousand kill skill for her, for Agatha. Okay, I'll get rid of this one since I have a slots right there. Stars. Um, let's see. I'm gonna be honest, I probably will never use this. I want to use this because it looks cool, but it doesn't mean it's that good compared to a lot of things. I mean, I just got this with that has that many slots. Stars. Um, I'll get rid of this. That's enough for now. Get rid of this. Stars. Materials. Rupees. I had another rupees. This one's worth 5200. I'll get rid of that. Gandorf's jewel, Dinolphus arm guard, piece of darkness armor, Dinolphus fang, Aerolphus leather, and 28 monster teeth. Did I just get the. I'm at 999 monster teeth. Wow. I need one more. So, give me a second while I figure this out. You know what? Since we did just beat him, let's play Ganondorf. Actually... Since we did just beat him, let's play Ganondorf. I mean... Oh, you've got to be... You son of a... I'm holding back my language, but I'm pissed. Because not only is this level 14, but you see the middle guy? That's Ganon. Do you remember that skill of saying I would never use versus Ganon on Ganondorf? Yeah? Guess what I have. <laughs> the game gave it to me, so I'm gonna use it. Wait, actually... Bizarre real quick. I actually can't. Uh, what do I need? Zelda's Sierra and Goma's Acid. So I need to fight against Zelda more often. After I finish the adventure map, I might just start grinding some more uh, materials. Especially the gold ones. Now, let's give him a few more levels. The reason I'm doing that is because honestly, this is level 14. I've never done a level 14 mission. Alright. Hey, Ganon. Gotcha. Alright, and you need to be sure to do it the moment he fires that. Gotcha, I can't do that anymore. Prepare my bombs since he might do that one now. No, he's not. He's instead doing that one. Ow! Ow! That damage, though. Tear off his tail. Barely. All right. If he'll ever freaking attack me with his giant ball of energy. 
Gotcha. Gendorf Medium. And now he's pulling a Goma. Are you just gonna keep pulling a Goma? Gotcha. All right, hit you one last time before your thing goes back up. What do you mean keep my distance from Ganon? Oh my gosh. Come on, Ganon. Rush at me, dude. Two giant bosses have partnered up. One right behind me, whoever it may be. It's Goma. Crap. I walk right into that. I'm not gonna get an A rank on this. Right. Ah. On cannon. Get him, please. Get him, please. Get him. Please. Rage against me. I've never seen that attack. Wait, I think I have. I think he used it once when I was replaying the mission, but I never let him actually get the attack. I saw it immediately went, nope, 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 nope. Just like I'm saying nope to his face right now. Almost five minutes in, I finally began it. Come on, Goma, I need you to shoot your laser. Come on. Be enough. There we go. Take that! Ah, uh, not as much as I was hoping. It was, in fact, a Ganon skill that was doing that much damage. Another one on him. I even got a material out of it. And I think I finished off Goma. Man, this has been intense. But, we're finally at our end. All 
Alright, come on. Almost got you, Dodongo. First hit. Ah, not as much as I was hoping. Oh well. Another big hit on him, and I should be able to beat him with those two SP I'm about to get. Yeah, I do mean to throw bombs at him. Let's see how much damage I deal. Yeah, this should do it. Alright, that took seven and a half minutes. By golly, that frickin'. Oh my! Wow! That was my most difficult battle. It's, and I got an A rank? Oh my gosh! Like, some of them are just like, oh my gosh, this is difficult. That was the most threatening thing I've ever seen. And I actually got an A rank. I fought Ganon as Ganondorf. I fought with Goma and freaking King Dodongo. If this isn't freaking Ocarina of Time, then I don't know what is. Ocarina of Time where you play as Ganondorf. That's weird. <laughs> Alright. So guys, on that note, next time let's play Hyrule Warriors Adventure Map. We'll be going to the next missions. We're still trying to take care of the top left corner. I got Goma's asset. Get up. Get up. I got Goma's Acid, which I just started stuttering over my own words right there. But yeah, I got that, which is something I needed. <sighs> we can play as Midna or more Ganondorf, which I'm actually kind of feeling Ganondorf. So we'll see how that turns out. See you guys next time.